Choose your fighter. Lady Inspired. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Bravely Default. So, last time, we finally made it to the snowy area. Um, but I wanted to do some side quests. I want to do some side quests. And I also needed to... I also needed to become stronger. I feel like before we fight the next boss. Oh wait, what was I... There's... I know because the next boss fight is going to be, um, I need a shield, a shield master, which Adele's leveled up pretty well. I just want to make sure I'm prepared. See, I really like this game, it's just, there's so much grinding that happens. Patch my tent up. Some fragile oil ought to do the trick. So getting it will entail some beefy bashing. Oh, I see. I need to kill everything in this area. Bumblewhacker. Okay, that's new. Uh, physical attack, they're extremely... kill everything until it eventually drops. Back here. We have the upper hand. You rang? What beasts? What beasts are over here? Oh! 
comes. Right, let's see. Almighty Slayer! Guess it's my turn. Yeah, pal. Guess nothing. We must not grow complacent. We're done already. Every day, every way, I get more. Awesome. Yay, we did it. Easy. That dream side quest is going to be really interesting, I feel. I don't know what the dream world looks like. We brought you that oil. Ah, oh, that's great. Thank you. Thank me when the job's done. Speaking of which, shall we get started? Wowzers! Where did you learn to fix tents like that, laddie? I used to be a sailor, so I was always climbing up and down masts, repairing sails. I learned how to patch an oil them pretty good. It may seem like a small thing, but out at sea, it can make all the difference. My shipmates used to call me the lifesaver. <laughs> Gosh. It's a little different now, though. These days, it's my friends saving my life instead. You're far too modest. Perhaps you do put your life on the line rather too eagerly. But I wouldn't be here if it weren't for you. You give me courage. The courage to continue fighting. Aw. Thanks, Gloria. That means a lot. Uh, it... It does? I... <clears throat> well, I was merely stating a fact. If you say so. Kodak, be with Gloria! Thanks. Look at her, oh, she's oh. Thickens Queen! Anyway, enough chatting. Let's get these repairs finished up, huh? I forgot how this story uh, started. With Bravely Default, but what? Didn't it start with him washing up on shore? Side quest to be had. in this place. Okay, I'll go back to this snowy area and um, try not to get killed. You know, eventually I do want to go back to... Um, I want to go back to... That one abandoned house that's over here in Rizwold. I want to see if I can defeat... 
I want to see if I can defeat like the wizards in that place. We've got the upper hand, guys. Why don't I continuously go out into the field? Like nothing. You rang? Oh, I. <laughs> Eat sorcery. All right, thunder. There's nothing. <laughs> Two arms. Yeah. Be slayer. It's now or never. I'm up, huh? Attack on a target, the heavier the equipment in the user's left hand. I mean, my equipment's not that heavy. Okay, then. Yeah! <laughs> that was a good one. Very well. Try this for size. No big deal. Oh, what's next? I wonder. Ah! All right, then. Check this out. <laughs> I'm getting kind of used to fighting now. Okay, let me, uh... Let me just camp out right next to this Yeti. I'm sure it will not mind. You know, this kind of reminds me of Tahoe in the winter. If any of you have been to Tahoe, during winter time, or There's if you no have it, I guess I should one. say. It's beautiful. What the hell is that? You rang? It is beautiful. Um, it's really nice around Christmas time. Um, it kind of, yeah, it kind of looks like this, especially if you take on like the back trails and every like, uh, maybe not like ski, ski hills so much because all the snow is just kind of up from all the skiers but if you go on like the quiet backwoodsy trail of like the neighborhoods it looks just like this So you're probably gonna I'm fan the flames. See, I've got my uses. Let us strike again. I shall take care of this. Dodge this if you can. Another foe that I do not intend to lose. I'm getting kind of used to fighting now. I mean, I don't know. It's just me. But I kind of want 
I kind of want them to end up together, Kodak and Gloria. I feel like she dies at the end, though, so... I just get the feeling that she's going to, like... Like, give her life up for her mission. Whatever that mission is. as aquatic. Here it comes. Well, what's next, I wonder? Quick! Shudder! I'm up, huh? chest over here. I feel it. Okay, now I'm gonna save in case a nasty surprise. This dark soul things. Do I have these already? I want to fight the bear. Bear! Bear! There we go. The way to open gets stuck in. Getting kind of used to fighting now. Andy, hello. How 
are you doing? Welcome to the stream. I'm doing okay. Thank you. <laughs> Catch me if you can. Catch me. What the? Oh, it's a demon. Okay, thank you. How about yourself? I was trying Baldur's Gate a little bit. How is it? So, Will gave me... He's like, do you honestly think you're going to play Baldur's Gate? Because if you don't think you are, I want to buy it for the PC. Instead of waiting, because then you can do mods. Are you doing mods? Well, I feel like... I feel like Baldur's Gate is a little easier than D&D, because in D&D you have to rely on dice. But I don't know, maybe Baldur's Gate has dice, so... Maybe that's part of it. It does have dice. Oh, I see. Easy. I'm used to actually fighting stuff, but there is turn-based combat with dice. Not my usual oh, thing. Looks like yeah, so... It's I, I guess if you're not used to D&D, okay, it can be a little bit weird. Because I've heard, I've heard comparisons that Baldur's Gate is kind of like Divinity Original Sins 2. And Divinity doesn't have any dice rolling or anything like that. Well, I got sent to jail in the first city I got to. That sounds very Andy. Because I found out about the ability where I could pick up and throw things. Are you throwing rocks at people? Consider as. I picked up a person and yeah, threw him off a cliff. That's. Uh, <laughs> Andy, the baddest of them all. I don't know why I'm in jail. Throw someone off a cliff. Someone spotted me. Well, I mean, and I got sent to jail. Did you have a choice? Did you choose to throw him off the cliff? Try this, besides. I do like it when that happens. This will be... Right, let's see. Okay. Yes. And then I got killed because I'm used to because I'm used to loot everything, but apparently that's stealing now, so I still 
Something sacred and the entire city attacked me and I died and had to start over. What the hell did you steal? Did you steal the Holy Grail? Here I go. Look at this tiny bee. May the earth engulf you. All right. You're done. I don't know, something like that. <laughs> I'm mostly just confused in that game. Well, I can, I can help you with that confusion. I'm just testing my limits. Well, okay. I mean, if you don't steal anything, then they're probably going to like you a bit more. <laughs> that just, you describing that just reminds me of like, of playing the Witcher. And it's like, well, the Nilfgaardian guards have a bunch of like, money and food in their tre in their chest, so I'm gonna steal it right in front of them and I hope they don't get mad. <laughs> but, 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 I say I have the option to pick anything and throw it, how am I not supposed to? Just get, I know you, Andy, you just get that urge to kill. Not even about loot, about wanting to throw someone off a cliff. saw a guy next to a cliff and I'm like, I wonder what happens if I throw him off the cliff. Will was telling me all the details you can have in that game, like character design wise, and some, I think some of the details are just kind of unnecessary. Okay, then. That was a good one. We must not grow complacent. Let us continue on our way. Will spent a long time making my character. Do you have like, can you send a screenshot of your character in the Discord? I, w I want to see. I need to. No, that's not fair. You saw me, I swung. It didn't hit. Hey, how did this happen? I could even take her clothes off. Oh, that's one of the things that Will told me about. That you can be very specific with uh, certain parts of your character, whether you're male or female. And I feel like stuff like that is unnecessary, but I mean, best believe, I don't know. That's I spend most of my time doing character design, as you probably noticed in Elden Ring. spend half the time summoning a copy of yourself to do all the work. That's not true, Andy. I spent all my time trying to get the copy of myself to do all the work. That was all my time. No, no, no. I just had a jellyfish most of the time. Oh, you mean Blide? Blade? However, God, I'm still so sad about that. Yeah, no place in the world. 
And it made him crazy. Oh. So how long how, how long did you play Baldur's Gate then? Like just getting used to the uh combat. Like one or two hours. There are so many games that I have like that I've started and I feel like I'm almost done with and then I, for one reason or another, I just stop playing. So in that final stretch, I'm just like, I don't pick it up for a few months. saying this earlier I really want yes I really want Gloria and the main character to end up together that's just me that's just my that's just me and my fan fiction heart I still don't know what these things are. They look like gateways or portals so I can fast travel faster than uh, the carriage in town. I'm trying to think, like, if Bard, if Bard would be a really good thing for Elvis in this area. It doesn't seem like Red, Red Mage, is that, is that good for him? You want to see my character? I do. Show me, show me, show me, show me, show me. Let's do this. You are about to witness my true power. Oh, okay. 
Okay, she cute. Kinda looks like Aloy, or someone would be in um, Horizon Zero Dawn. I can see she has the red hair and freckles. Like, uh, our dear darling. Looks good! You know, I had to make her red, red hair. Is there an option for, like, uh, even more? Like, vibrant red, kind of like Elden Ring? Or is it more, like, natural? They want you to stay somewhat natural to the world. I shall take care of this. Dodge this if you can. Well, what do you think? There's nothing. Okay then. Okay, so I think Monk is good for those souls things because it doesn't require any elemental or anything. You can use any color you want. There are like a hundred options of color. Now, I feel like if I were to make, if I were to stream Baldur's Gate or anything like that, like, I feel like the first stream alone would just be making a character. I like how the music just changes. Almighty flare! No! It counters magical attacks! Allow me. Hurts. Not physical attacks! Here I go! You rang? Let me see. Be healed! Oh, thanks for bailing me out. That was a good one. I must endure. Right, then. Body slam! Body slam! I tried to find the Aerith here, but I couldn't find it. Oh, you didn't want to make Aerith? Or is, is Aerith too sweet to be in Baldur's Gate? Did I find something I shouldn't have? That's a surprise. Oh. Come over here! I don't want to fight the spider. But I probably am going to fight the spider. a normal transition into the fight. So maybe it's fine. Right. Let's see. Counter any damage. Perhaps 
use you. Might help. Okay then. Focal blast. Okay, they have a bit of health. Allow me. Oh, they're kind of kicking my ass though. Alright, I'll try some more at some point, but I don't really know if it's a game for me. I prefer action combat games. Oh yeah, because you're not really like a turn-based person. Their plants. This should do it. So let me go ahead. Almighty wind. Oh. Stop. I want you to know, attacks, dodge, and everything here. It's just wait for your turn, choose an attack. Well, yeah. I don't know. I feel like some turn based games, like uh, this game and Dragon Quest XI, are really fun. But I can see why that can get tired some, especially if you have to rely on dice. Because let me tell you something playing DD is really fun until. You're in like a moment that you want to be like super cool, but then you get like a really low roll, and then that just throws off your entire mood for the rest of the game. Okay. Let me see. Does that feel better? You rang? Hey, I'll see you running away. They kept taking my stuff. I didn't like it. Oh yeah, some idiot jumped on me and was holding me down and I had the option to smash him in the face. But no, I rolled a three, so I guess I couldn't do that. Kind of annoyed me. And you're just like, if this was Elden Ring, you'd be dead by now. I see you, I see your bloodlust. Was it part of a, a quest or was it just like a random enemy that sprung up on you? Have I not gone for my the darling options? Yes, our dear darling trick. In my first Witcher playthrough. Didn't you tell me that your first Witcher playthrough was like... You like went with all like the bad options? Or was that other playthroughs? I tried to romance everyone. I got none. Oh... We must make the most of this opportunity. What are these assholes? Let me see. Oh my! I'm up, huh? I can take it. Let me go! You will regret your 
impersonates. You want to know when I really started hating Yen? I still am not forgiven her for what she did. Didn't you say that, like... What did you say? God, it was your first playthrough. Oh, yeah! It was... Didn't you go up to her in the room of Kara Morin and then she got really pissed because you're just like... Yeah, I lost my memory, so I started dating Triss, and then she threw you into the lake, as she does when that dialogue pops up. Ah, I don't believe it. Please, you must get up. Oh dear. Uh, I think this about. dungeon's you too high for me. Impressions. Right before the Battle of Karamori, and yeah, she threw me in the lake, and there was no teleport option, so I had to run all the way back up. I mean, I think that's just what happens um, when you hook up with your girlfriend's best friend. They tend to get uh, pretty pissed. Dude, she was never my girlfriend. I mean, she was your on and off girlfriend. Mostly off, but still on and off. Be more tense. Yes, come this way. Haha. I think you should make Yen and Baldur's game. Cause that way, if what I saw, a girl takes all he. Allow me. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. Geralt, um, Geralt isn't really known for uh, sticking to one girl. I want to know why all the sorcerers, like, though, go after him. Because isn't he described as, like, a weird guy with a gravelly voice in the books? A weird guy with a weird voice. And sorceresses are so up their own ass that I don't know why they're, they go after Geralt. Basically everyone but Philippa Eilhart. sorceresses are into weirdos. Well, I don't know. Maybe it's like... Because I know Geralt describes them as pretty girls with the eyes of ugly girls. So maybe, like... I don't know. Maybe they just feel like down about themselves and they're like, well, here's this weird guy. So maybe I'll fit in more with him. Might be that most witchers has two sorcerers. Gara has three, one for humans, one for monsters, and one for sorceresses. I feel it. Yeah, but the thing is... Okay, that was a bad joke. No, but the thing is... Once he sleeps with them... Uh, they feel like they own his three swords. You know what I'm saying? So I don't, I don't know why they think it ever would work. I mean, I guess to be fair, the only ones who ever thought it would work out is Fringilla Vigo. 
And then uh, Geralt just up and left her. Geralt, especially with the mutton chops. The YouTuber I really like, uh, who does all the Witcher lore and reviews. Oh no, oh no. Uh, he made it to where, so you know those, like, peasants that have, like, the bull haircut? He modded it to where Geralt has that with his mutton chop beard. Let's not bring back the mutton chops. We'll be your best Geralt. Oh, I got jumped by a polar bear. You know what's interesting? I think in the books he describes how, given the option, he prefers to be clean shaven because he gets lice in his beards. Very well. Be here. Human Slayer! No. Human Slayer! Kill the human! Two arms. Like you always play these turn. Wait a on. We'll be over here. Like you always play these turn based games. I don't know. I think, like. Well, I am going to be playing, what is it, Uncharted 3, so that's not turn-based. I don't want to hear any nonsense about playing only turn-based games. But you have to remember the deal, Andy. You have to be nice to yourself when I'm playing Uncharted 3. I'm great. <laughs> Which, I, I'm very proud of you. I feel like oh in chat, fire. you have been more nice to yourself. You have been nicer. I feel like that's a good thing. So yeah, I'm going to be playing Uncharted 3 after this. I'm very proud of you, Andy. Come on. All right, then. Get ready. Nothing like a battle to get a guy warmed up. With his tiny feet. Well, I'm proud of you, Casey. Oh, uh, it's... Well, plus... Uh, I don't know. I'm going into my last semester, and I don't, I, I don't know how busy I'm actually going to be. So... Just bear with me. It might, it might take... It might take a little bit in between streams to actually get to Uncharted 3, but... That's the plan I have. A shot. Is this a shop? No, that's an inn. Dude, I have to walk all the way up those stairs. For the sh okay. Have you played Dark Souls 3 before, Andy? 
Doesn't this remind you of like the capital city where Lothrin? Or no, the, like the DLC? that even a question? Dark Souls 3? I feel like now that I beat Elden Ring, I feel like Dark Souls 3 would be somewhat easier to beat. But I don't know if that's just me being cocky. You stand accused of the most heinous of Oh, are we gonna see that Andy throw of someone off a cliff? A okay, let me fairy in disguise. But but Bishop Helio, I never Hush, child. Hush I pray as fervently as you do that these abominable accusations are proved false. Turns out but she just like stole something from the drop kitchen. Of wine tainted the pail of clearest water. Still doth the blemish remain. Such is the nature of suspicion. This guy is just trying and to use so bigger words to sound we turn smarter. To the purifying judgment of the holy, that your innocence might be demonstrated beyond all doubt. Call <laughs> upon the Lord of Dragons, who watcheth o'er us all. Ask of him that your guiltlessness be confirmed. All right. I, I hereby call upon your judgment. Lord of Dragons, watch over me. Yeah, they're just going to push her of off. Dragons, watch over us all. Lord Don't of put Dragons, yourself in that position, girl. Get inland. What's going on here? This doesn't feel right. I don't know, you have less. So, is that what you did, Andy? She jumped. Lord of Dragons, watch over us all. Lord of Dragons, watch over us all. Why are you all just standing there? She jumped, damn it. Straight into the arms of the Lord. That she might be judged and found free of sin. But, but she'll. If her faith is strong, she will be returned to us soon enough. Archbishop Dominic! But... This guy's but evil. How can you be sure? How dare you ask such a thing? You actually have to and keep trying until you kill too. the boss. I mean... Come, children. I know Dark we Souls 3 more. Because I've seen so many... Way. Playthroughs Randall and of different arms, YouTubers, so I'm more Tell familiar with the, the bosses than I am Bibles. with Elden Ring bosses. There I will teach you a little of his draconic majesty. My sister was no fairy. How? How could they? Well, I'm all for you playing Dark Souls 3. I'm not going to stream Dark Souls 3. I've already attempted that. I think twice. Was it? Not even close, I'm afraid. Sounds like we need to go and ask a certain someone a few questions. To the Hall of High there we Holies. Go. Uh, you sure we want to just go barging yeah, in? Yeah, I've already. It's not barging in. I've already tried us, uh, streaming Dark Souls as as to ask about 3 the twice. Yes. Um, come on. I think this is before, yeah, this is before you followed us. So, did Reiji come out? No, it didn't. So I think playing by myself, um, like playing the game and not being, uh, like just enjoying it by myself, I think. I'll take that as a- no, I did- you- you have no proof! You have no proof! Will, where are you? Will is at Digimon right now. 